Show You Care is such a fantastic campaign. And it's for us at home, who perhaps, like me, have friends and family around all the time, but it's for us to show that people who are isolated are not on their own, you can help them. Um, and if you contact uh, Kent Fire and Rescue Service, then they'll send you an email, they'll give you all the bullet points of ways you can help. Um, it could be something really tiny, just by giving like five minutes of your time once a week, or something like going into their homes, making sure that their fire alarms are working, making sure that, you know, perhaps if people have dementia, and, you know, making sure the pots and pans are put away, and just safety. It's just basically common sense and safety, but some people out there are vulnerable and they need your support and help, and you can give it. I have a family, I have children, I have a husband, and I have brothers and sisters, and we all look after each other. I would hate to think that I was living completely on my own and feeling like I had nobody to, to watch my back. And I think through this campaign, you know, we're asking people to get involved, To it, it might be just to give half an hour once a week to pop in to an elderly neighbour just to make sure they're okay, but that half an hour to that person means the world and they don't feel so isolated and so forgotten. So um, I think that from my point of view, I'm very lucky that I have a wonderful network of friends and family, but I think it's our duty, if you like, to make sure that nobody feels alone. I'm amazed that in Kent, there are over 40,000 over 65s that are isolated and vulnerable. I am astonished, I really am, but you know, with this campaign, we can do something about it and we can make them feel more secure, more safe and feel like somebody cares. And I think, isn't that great? It really is. The way you can help through Show You Care is perhaps you have an elderly neighbour and maybe you think that they have family that looks after them. But you know, don't just sit back and wait for someone else to look after them. Just knock on the door and make sure they're okay. And maybe someone's vulnerable because they have dementia or they have mental issues. You can help. Don't always think that someone else is going to do that job because if nobody does, they are isolated. They are vulnerable and they need your help. And it could be something so simple and take so little time, but it means the world to them.